coming to cobalt 60 it is not found in nature why because it has a bahut chota jindagi hai unka short life 5.27 years only hence it is not found in nature now doctor shoot me an answer cough coryza conjunctivitis rash spreading from head to toe including hands and feet right measles a measles without conjunctivitis is an unlikely diagnosis you know that conjunctivitis is essential component in uh, uh, concluding it as a measles a rash forming illness now spontaneous rupture of membranes what do we do we examine the fluid of meconium typically we examine the fluid for blood we auscultate the fetal heart rate they are all the part uh, of uh, assessment if there is a spontaneous rupture foul odor dark red fluid meconium staining everything what is the meaning of effacement it is the degree of cervical thinning with the progression of the true labor is effacement what is the latent period these calculations of the Friedman spartogram are very important doctor and how much you have done the labor room postings is very very essential so when do you call latent phase active phase maximum rate of descent this is available in every book but my job is to remind you that uh, precisely you don't you can't give your own personal figures of six hours eight hours ten hours or anything exactly what is being defined by American College of gynecologists must be mentioned in the tomorrow's exam progressive cervical effacement if it is there then you call it as active labor that's good now uh, why should a patient should come to a hospital for evaluation you must tell the mother if the child is moving slowly you ever get that feeling please come running home running to the hospital if there is vaginal bleeding sudden gush of fluid breaking of the waters there are all the indications the regular contractions are expected is not considered to be an indication similarly true labor versus false labor how do we differentiate is one of the favorite questions of the examiner now active phase of the stage one labor what is the duration as I told you already uh, earlier table will speak about uh, normal multi para nulli para everything you must be very sure now myomectomy oxytocin difficult forceps anything can lead to the development of the uterine rupture at the perineal floor you call it as the outlet forceps if the baby is less than 2 kgs don't try out uh, a vaginal delivery of a term breach now there is no descent of the presenting part for over 1 hour in the second stage of the labor then it is the classical definition of an arrest disorder when do you call arrest of dilatation when the cervix achieve 6 centimeters of dilatation but then does not change further for nearly 2 hours when you call arrest of descent the fetal head moves from the station minus 2 to minus 1 uh, but then makes no further progress so this is how you basically uh, define uh, then uh, when do you call protracted active phase in the case of the nulliparous patients if the cervical change is less than 1.2 centimeter per hour or in the multiparous women the cervical change is less than 1.5 centimeter per hour then that defines the protracted active phase so these are the some of the common definitions which you need to remember shoot me an answer bactericidal inhibit formation of initiation complex causes the misreading of mRNA which antibiotic I am breaking the head what is your answer a minor glycoside is an answer from Anantapur 
that's right gentamycin neomycin emicacin tobramycin not erythromycin not azithromycin be very sure huh? what are macrolides aminoglycosides there is a difference now in multiparous patients when do you call prolonged active phase typically if it lasts more than 6 hours becomes the definition now doctor early deceleration is head compression variable deceleration is cord compression and uh, late deceleration is fetal hypoxia as all of you know very well so early fetal heart rate decelerations can be physiological and need not be a concern always um, because uh, they occur at the time of the uterine contractions uh, they can uh, coexist now if there is any fetal compromise which tocolytic you want to fundamentally use uh, to decrease the uterine uh, tone so basically beta 2 agonistic agent like turbutylene max sulfate they all act like the tocolytic agents then uh, when will endometrium get re-established in the puerperal period it takes at least 21 days third week then uh, shoot me an answer bacteriostatic binds to 30 years prevents amino acyl trna attachment and it has a very limited cns penetration what is a uh, important drug that's good guntur dr anuja everybody answering correctly what is your answer huh? excellent doctor tetrasex see you are all going to get seat uh, that's the reason uh, you are sharp sharp with antibiotics means telltale sign doctor demiclocycline is another drug you need to remember it is an antagonist to adh hence we use it in the treatment of sidh treatment of sidh and it can cause nephrogenic in diabetes insipidus rogam 300 milligrams which we give how much uh, it will effectively neutralize doctor 15 ml is what it will rogam is what anti rh antibody that we basically administer percreta means entire thickness of the muscular uterine wall is involved when do you call significant postpartum bleed doc whenever it is more than half liter is considered to be if there is a retained placenta how can you realize it you can do an ultrasound and be able to prove that if there is a postpartum infection what predisposes to it any prolonged labor anemia even anemia and premature rupture any of them can predispose to development of postpartum infection suction curettage is only mainly in the first trimester whereas all the remaining which are mentioned are part of the second trimester now doctor in a premature baby you have given indomethacin and tried to close the ductus is there any chance of recurrence of its once more reopening very much it's only a medical closure which you have done so prostaglandins maintain patency of the ductus indomethacin closes the ductus but that closure is not a permanent closure now coming to the growth the newborn babies lose initially around 8% of the birth weight male newborns have an average higher birth weight uh, option C is wrong that is skeletal development in boys is not earlier than in the case of the girls rather vice versa is true now coming to the drug which drug blocks the peptide bond formation should be an answer which is bacteriostatic it acts on 50 s one confident answer excellent you are murmuring they are already answering what is your answer two chloramphenicol as rightly answered by our doc from guntur hyderabad everywhere that's good what can a two year old child cannot do he cannot ride a tricycle because he has to wait up to third year 36 months 
delayed bone age is not a problem in familial short stature whereas hypothyroidism any hormonal deficiency delays bone age any excess hormones will speed up the bone age now a four year old he can draw a man with the heads and leg with head and legs uh, that is the only true statement out of all i think uh, other options are also correct in this uh, there must be some repair of this uh, question uh, this, this is one uh, foul smelling question now coming to primary atypical pneumonia typically tetracycline is a drug there is a dissociation between radiology and uh, the clinical findings and uh, uh, fifth disease what is your answer rash high fever constitutional symptoms is not a feature it is not high fever it is always a low grade fever with headache and upper respiratory infection with a slapped cheek what do you find in fifth disease huh? now tell me doctor should be an answer azithromycin prophylaxis you want to give in hiv how much cd4 count ke niche hai to dete or uh, again as what you want to give azithromycin which opportunistic infection two answers guntur says 200 rmc kakinada says 50 ravindranath says 200 shiva says 200 200 pneumocystis carinae pneumonia then what is trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole we give for that purpose only no our bana answer that's right shiva is right mycobacterium avium intracellular and rmc is right for the number 50 so they both should get adjacent seats in order to correctly answer in the tomorrow's prometric uh, seating arrangement so cd4 less than 50 azithromycin we give for mycobacterium avium whereas cd4 less than 100 we give trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole against both toxoplasma and pneumocystis below 200 we give trimethoprim basically for pneumocystis carinae pneumonia what kind of trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole ds double strength is what you need to give okay doc कितना आलू कितना परोटा कितना घी दही यू मस्ट डिसाइड फॉर ए डायबिटिक पेशेंट सो कार्बोहाइड्रेट 50 परसेंट फैट 30 परसेंट प्रोटीन 20 परसेंट इज वॉट नीड टू बी रिमेंबर्ड वेरी गुड वी रीच द एंड डॉक्टर बिफोर इट इज थ्री ओ क्लॉक एग्जैक्टली टू सो सिक्स इयर ओल्ड हाइपोटेंस वेन के फिलोपति always you need to use a jet airways uh, i mean jet fighter plane kind of a drug which will drastically bring down so sodium nitroprusside is the one which we basically prefer for hypertensive encephalopathy